Hi, welcome to Assassin's Creed, and this is a bit of a uh, trading sort of ledger guide. I know that the um, game gives you a pretty good guide, but it took me a little while to work out how to maximize my profit. First of all, stockpile. Uh, this will show you stuff that your artisans and uh, workers can make. I tend to spend most of my time buying stuff from the forest. Uh, this is what you're going to need for most of the crafting. Um, but also hunting, and I'll come to that in a second. But the hunter sells beaver pelts from level one. Uh, and they are worth a ridiculously high profit. So anyway, you want to, uh, the first guy that you get will sell you oak lumber and oak bark. So you want to make sure that you buy that. And then go to crafting and create land convoy. And the land convoy requires uh, oak bark and oak lumber, timber, whatever it's called. Then we go oak bark and oak lumber. And it also requires Lance, who is the guy that you save uh, in the very first homestead mission. Uh, he is uh, on a cliff and gets pushed over with a rope attached to his feet. And that's at the end of sequence 5, so it's hard to miss. Anyway, make two land convoys as quickly as you can. Uh, that's the most you appear to be able to have, three in total. And then uh, later on you're able to level up your artisans so that they can make uh, better stuff. And I've done the mission to fight and also to catch a thief, which appear at the beginning of sequence 6. And this allows me now to make pine lumber and also kindling. And with this, I'm going to upgrade my land convoy capacity. So now, instead of carrying three items each, they'll be able to carry five, because I'm, oops, sorry, I'm going to upgrade it twice. Uh, crafting, back into here, have a look at recipes. And it's always worth having a look at recipes. It'll show you who you need. See, there's four there now. It'll show you who you need uh, to build it, and the items that you need to build it, and whether or not you've got them. So I'm just going to uh, upgrade that one more time. But unfortunately right now I've got no more pine lumber left, so I can't upgrade them again. But we're going to have a little look at trading. And trading is a great way to make a lot of money very, very quickly. And I'm surprised more people haven't done this. Uh, the reason I know they haven't is because I just got a message saying I'm in the top 10% of uh, land convoy earnings, which seems surprising. But anyway, you go to your land convoy. Uh, you'll see that you can fill it up, but then go to the stockpile and just buy as many beaver pelts as you can afford. If you can't, you can always go hunting for wolf pelts outside, and you'll see in a minute that wolf pelts are super valuable. Um, but go to the land convoy here, and all you're going to do is add an item, scoot down to hunting, add the beaver pelt, and then give it to one of the merchants who's available. And they'll give you different prices, so make sure that you pick the one who is worth the most. And I'm just going to add five beaver pelts to uh, the first land convoy. There we go. And they're all going to go to this dude here. And then you hit the button to send it off on the Xbox. It's Y. Uh, and confirm the convoy. And there we go. That's 2,000 gold coming in just a minute. However, we paid nearly 1,000 for the beaver pelts. So if you've got your own skins, if you've been doing some hunting, and there are loads of wolves around the homestead, um, you can add those. I just did a bear in a previous mission. Uh, and that's worth 600, which is pretty nice. Uh, deer pelts aren't too shabby. Uh, there's a bobcat pelt for 181. That's kind of worthless, but I'm just going to get rid of it. Uh, deer pelts are, I think, 350-ish, 310. So add that. Uh, uh, but the most interesting ones, the easiest to come by, and with a pretty good price, are wolf pelts. Wolf pelts are worth about 340. So uh, stick those in and send them off. And this is all pure profit because you've just spent time um, skinning wolves that have attacked you anyway, right? So now we're making about 2,000 again. Um, but instead of having to lay down 1,000 profit, that's uh, 1,000 outlay, that's uh, 2,000 more profit. And then finally I'm going to send the third one off and I'm just going to fill it with the beaver pelts we've just bought. So there we go. And sending them all to this guy. But there we go. That means that in about 12 minutes we're going to get three convoys back with around 6,000 golds worth of value in them. And then we can come back here and start it all again. But remember to keep an eye on your, um, remember to keep an eye on all your maps and look for homestead missions to upgrade your artisans to the maximum possible. Anyway, I hope that was useful. Uh, let me know in the comments if you've got any questions or you think I've missed anything. And remember to keep an eye on your crafting. All right, lots of love. Bye.